I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it's gonna be, who gonna be, we gonna be, it's gotta be, I gotta be trained, trained, from the first time I show my head, I gotta be trained, trained, from the first time I show my head, I gotta be trained, trained, trained. You're watching Spotlight MVS on Creme TV. I'm your girl Twee. I'm here in the company of the beautiful, lovely, talented Belizean Vibes that come. Only hear about Belizean Vibes that come. Only still want to represent Belizean Vibes that come to the world hard to the fullest. Yeah, I want to see who that person behind Belizean Vibes that come. And I make sure you introduce yourself to them and tell them what all Belizean Vibes that come is about. So tell them about that. What's up? Hello, Belize. Hello, world. I'm Myrna and I'm the CEO of BelizeAndVibes.com. It's five years running and what we do, we promote Belizean entertainment, Caribbean entertainment. You gotta say Belizean slash Caribbean entertainment because it all falls with support to Jamaica and the Trinidadians, all the Caribbean community for all the dance hall, reggae, all the upcoming festivals all over the world. If it's Canada, Japan, right Tweety? Anyway. You stay late, Jazz Reggae. We're going to talk a little bit on that later. Anything going on in Belize, what happened is all the promoters, all the DJs, all the artists worldwide, they connect with BelizeAndVibes.com to get the word out about upcoming events. And BelizeAndVibes.com is where you find it. pictures, events, anything, you name it, anything in regards to Caribbean effect, Music, log on to BelizeAndVibes.com. Like I said, anything linked to DJs, artists, and we're also, you know, focusing on R&B and, and hip hop coming up soon. So check it out. Stay tuned. BelizeAndVibes.com. You want to give them one little number? You see the Jazz Reggae because all the artists I represent BelizeAndVibes.com to the fullest. Yeah, come on, me for be some bragging, but yeah, I want to tell them one little before you see the Jazz Reggae 2010. How that me gone? What role you play? UCLA Jazz Reggae has been going on. It's a student-run event, and it's been going on for like 24 years plus. And it started with just a small show. It used to be free. Then it moved up to $5 and stuff. And you know, with the artists' prices going up, yes, dance hall reggae artists ain't the cheapest, you know, to find nowadays. And so what happened to it is that um, when I implemented Belize and Vibes that come five years ago, that was the same time I started working as an artist relations director in UCLA Jazz Reggae. It's a festival, one of the largest student-run event in the USA, and we pulled approximately 30,000 people in two days. It's a Sunday, Monday, every Memorial Day weekend. You can find it on the site, look up jazzreggaefestival.com, look up belizeandvibes.com, check the pictures, the pictures was crazy. And you know, we've, we've done artists from all different genres. We've done R&B, we've done Jill Scott, Erica Badu, we've done the best of um, dance hall and reggae. We've had from Bouja Banton, Elephant Man, Mr. Vegas. We've had Itana, we've had Movado on stage. We've had Degree, you name it. You know, we, we pull out the best. We try to intertwine the jazz and soften it up with some R&B because of course, you know, sometimes the older folks that's more attracted to the jazz doesn't really support the show. And so therefore, we work along with the younger. Our um, demographic is about 18 to like 35. And this year, UCLA Jazz Reggae 2010, it was a sold out up here, right, Tweety? Yeah. Tweety was there, yes. yes. Tweety herself, Linda Blaze, who's behind the camera producing this show right now, was there. Um, Linda flew in, yeah, she flew in like big time. Linda flew in on the Sunday, connected up to the stage. It was mad, it was crazy, the hype was crazy. Tweety was there hosting the Reggae Day, which is on Monday, May 31st. 31st, Memorial Day weekend, like I said. Every year, it's an annual event. Yo, Tweety came out there and she rocked the show. Tweety came out and was like, yo, 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 UCLA. You know, I mean, the feedback, the energy. You know, she got out there, she did her thing. So I'm really proud of her, you know. As Belizeans and as female in the entertainment business, it's not always the easiest thing. We don't always get the best rep, but you gotta understand it's a lot of hard work behind the scenes. It's not only on the forefront about meeting the artists, meeting the DJs, we don't have time for that. The production takes approximately nine months, and if you all are looking at MVS Spotlight this week, you already seen some of the clips from Sham, you know, Barrington, Great. Levy, man, it was crazy. You had Nas and Damien there. Leah Gilling and Tweedy was the host and MC. The crowd was crazy. It was sold out from the Saturday before the show. As Artist Relations Director for the show, 
I try to collaborate a number of artists, the best you can find. It's not always about hardcore dance hall. It's not always about what the people want. You know, a certain genre of people is what gonna sell off a show. And so this year we went with Nas and Damian Marley, Barrington Levy, Sham, Itana, and of course we had our very own Belizean artist on stage, Kano, block work, you already know, they locked yeah. Los Angeles, yeah. check them out. You had Caramel, who's an upcoming Belizean artist. Yeah. I try to push our Belizean artists as much as we can. You know, there's some issues with that. We could talk on another show about why the Belizean artist does not get the exposure they want, but there's a whole lot more to it. Visa issues and sponsorship, but at the same time, we had our Belizeans on stage, we had Belizeans DJ, right? We had yeah. a Frank Champion song, we had Tweedy as a Belizean hosting the show. This is huge for the Belizean community because it's one of the largest student run events. 30,000 people in two days. Check BelizeanVibes.com, the pictures are there, look up UCLA Jazz Reggae, you know. And um, if you guys are in the California area next year, May Memorial Day weekend, be sure to get your tickets early because it's going to be another solo out of it. And that's what I do, I enjoy it. I'm also an employee at UCLA, but at the same time, UCLA Jazz Reggae is my baby. I enjoy working with the students. These are 18, 19, and 20 year old students currently attending UCLA, and they do this as a project, and it's amazing what these kids can produce. Linda been there, Tweed have been there, they had seen it live. It's mad, it's crazy, it's one of the largest shows. You guys gotta check it out, check out the videos, check out the website. YouTube, Google, UCLA, Jazz Reggae, it's all, we're all over, it's a worldwide thing. And that's what I enjoy, hopefully we can bring that show to Belize one day. one day. You know, we're gonna need space, of course, maybe MCC grounds or National Stadium, because, yeah. you know, it's full 15,000 people, is no joke. But it can happen. From production to showtime, Tweety Allen in the Belize, with it alongside Belize and Vibes that come and I don't know. Vibes, do you have anybody you want to big up? For LA, because I don't know the stream going live for you, she may want to up anybody in LA, Belize, where I just say. You guys already know we also have Belize and Live going on new stream every Friday night. Tweet is now in Belize, so I'm going to try and do the thing and have Tweety call in on the show. You can also check out Belize and Vibes that come click on any of the Belize and Vibes live links and you could look at all the recordings, you know. We're going to be coming back soon, we're going to do the thing again, and we also could do it, you know, we electronically, we're going to be loading up all the MBS Spotlight videos, we've got to big up Linda, as always, Linda and Tweedy has been two of the members that has been supporting Belize and Vibes that come to the fullest. I'm in Los Angeles, I visit occasionally, but Linda and Tweedy have been holding it down here in Belize, so i got to say a big shout out to Linda, please, and Tweedy, because when it comes to production, these two ladies got it, trust me, they got it, you know. They take directions well, and it was proven at UCLA Jazz Reggae. They knew what to do, they hold on interviews, they conducted themselves professionally, they handled all the interviews with the artists, they were backstage helping me, checking in VIPs, we had stage lock, we had backstage lock, they helped with everything, assisted in every way you can, so I gotta give mad props to Linda and Tweety for come, you know, sticking by me. And of course, I gotta pick up my big sis, because you already know we're in her studio right now. Big up Brenda, Marley, right. and Zoe, because you don't know. Belama, if you don't know about the studios, coming soon. Belama, Belama, Belize and Vibes that comes to the Belama. Check it out. Yes, and you know, I have mad love with the family list goes on and on and on. I have my mom's family here, my dad's family. It's huge. So you all know who you are. Big up yourself, same way. I wanna big up all the DJs. You have Belize and Movement, who has been part of. Belizean Vibes crew for a very long time. You have Tag International, you have Stone Jam Family, you have Lady X. Look out for the All Black Affair coming up November 13th. Yeah. Sold out. We're gonna have it. Boat Ride, we're gonna have the After, after party. party. That's also one of my productions, one of my largest productions that I do. All Black Affair. Linda Blee has been there. This year, Tweet is supposed to be Yo. there. You got Federation 501. Linda, big up yourself the same way every time. You know, there's so many people on the list, on the roster, but again, you know, the list goes on. You know who you are. Mad love to the family, mad love to my family, my mom, who supported me, being there. She's been there many times when I'm updating the website and everything else. Log on to BelizeAndVibes.com. It's something that's growing, it's getting bigger, it's a worldwide thing. If you have any comments, link me up on Facebook, on MySpace. We do it worldwide. Tweet, Twitter, you know, Tweety. <laughs> everything. Yo, it's a love. Just see it on the Belizean vibes.com. 
the person itself. We don't hear the name, we don't see the person. Myrna right now, yeah, that's all the things that you're Myrna. Make up yourself every time. You hold it down like LA. I could say, Lynn Tweedy could say, Linda Blaze could say, Belize and Vibes that come got LA for luck. right now in here.